Can you floss? Of course. Yeah. Oh, I've never seen your floss. You've never seen me floss? No. Go. Of course I can floss. <laughs> Go. There goes her flossing. Kiss my boo boo. Hey guys, welcome back to the weekly vlog. So it's actually two Fridays from when you're watching this. So I just edited the weekly vlog going up last week and now I'm starting a new one kind of early for the following week because we are going away for the weekend. So I wanted to vlog it for you guys. So Yarmin had to work all day. So it's 5.30 and it's like dark out and it feels really weird to be like about to going. That was not English. It feels really weird right now to be leaving on a road trip this late because it's like dark, but we're gonna be driving up to Vermont for the weekend. It's like a three and a half hour drive, but Vermont is so beautiful this time of year and we just need a little weekend away. So we're gonna have a little weekend getaway. We're all packed and just finishing up some last minute stuff and we're gonna hit the road. I am so excited. I'm wearing this top that I got from Dolls Kill. It's so cute. Yes. <laughs> all right, we made it four hours later because we stopped for dinner as well. But we're staying at the Snowflake. I love that name. So it's like Snowflake with a T. So cute because we're in Stowe, Vermont. Um, and oh my god, like it's just so cozy here. It's 9.30. Oh my god, it's so cute. Should we park out front and like check in first? Okay, so we're in a totally different part now. About to check into our room. It's so cozy. So cozy. Oh. Look at this spa, guys. It has a waterfall. The receptionist told us about the spas and how there's like different soaking tubs. Oh my god, it's dark, but there's a fireplace. Guys, this is so nice. This is so lovely. I'm obsessed. So cute. I'm so excited that they have a freaking... Yeah, that's not... That's so cool. Oh, wow. That reminds me of my old apartment. Had a fireplace like this, a gas one. And it gets hot, too. And then, outside, you can see the lights of the patio, or the courtyard. This is so cozy. I'm obsessed with it here, and we just got here. This is lovely. We made it! That was a long ride, huh? I'm tired. I know. 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 Look at your girl. Just chilling. Welcome to my crib. Hi. This bathtub is ginormous, and I am gonna be staying in here for the rest of our trip. This bathroom is ginormous. Look That's at that huge. Mirror. I love it. This is a good bathroom. Ooh. Oh, one thing I noticed has two sinks. That's what I love. His and hers. Yeah. Or his and his and hers and hers. Whatever. I love that the bathroom is separate. The toilet. The toilet. I love that it's separate. I'm really content. We need this bathtub in our house. I need a fat friendly bathtub. No, 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 Bubba, no, no, Bubba. You got up real quick. No, I never seen you get up that quick. I, I said, stop. I said, stop. I said. Thank you, damn. If you guys know that TikTok, I love you. Uh, that's a good one. Alex is happy. Damn. You had like no energy to ride up here. That car ride sucked. And then all of a sudden it's coming out now. Yeah. What are we going to do now? I don't know. I'm tired, but I'm a grandpa. So can you floss? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I've never seen your floss. You've never seen me floss? No. Go. Of course I can floss. <laughs> Go. <laughs> there goes her flossing. Kiss my boo boo. Okay. There's a lot of. They have a heat lamp. What's a heat lamp? That's a heat lamp. So like when you get out of the shower. Oh, it radiates energy, or it radiates heat. heat. <laughs> 
am living for this little sink. It's so cute! Good morning. Good morning. You knew I was going to do that. Yeah, like you get all ready and then you're just like, okay, ready? Good morning. <laughs> you're on to me. I am on to you. Um, you make the face. <laughs> I have a face. My mom makes fun of me too. She goes, hi guys. It's your girl, Alex. It's me, your boy. So we just got a tour of the hotel and it's pretty amazing. So, so many uh, amenities. Amenities. <laughs> amenities. No, like they go. have a whole sports club and it's like very fitness, yoga, like wellness nice. vibes. It's really nice. The sanctuary. I can't wait to show them the sanctuary. Mm, yeah. It, yeah. They have a, a men's and a women's Inside. one and then a co-ed with like a soaking bath waterfall. Oh my, my mind was blown. So if you guys want to see the hotel, here's a quick little tour. So now we're gonna get some breakfast and then hit Be up hungry. the spa. I'm starving. Cause we had a light dinner last night on the road. So now I'm just like hungry. So let's go get some breakfast. Okay, it is spa time. Breakfast was fire. I got a new suit from Kona Soul. I'll link it. It's mad cute. I'm ready to show you guys these healing waters. Heal me. Heal me. I had biscuits and gravy for breakfast. I don't think we're going the right way. We're definitely not. It's like this way. <laughs> oh yeah, it's down here. <laughs> we're good at this. Look at the mountainous views. Look at this mountain of man. <laughs> Is that weird to say? Spitting snow. Spitting snow. That's a thing people say. Spitting snow. Yeah. Like it's okay. just like a light dust. Like it's spitting. <laughs> like spitting snow. Okay. Like just tiny little. What? Why is it flakes. drizzling? That's rain. Okay. <laughs> so, we spent most of our morning and early afternoon at the spa, just like relaxing, as you guys saw. I didn't realize how comfortable the spa was. Like that warm water, I can like just be in there for days. And I've never been to a spa like that. That was no. incredible. This is like a vacation destination and they have like a shuttle where you can go ski. Look at the mountains. Yeah. yeah. 
You want to show them the mountains? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, I can look at them. But... I'm like, ah, oh, the mountains. And I'm like, <laughs> no. I'll show you guys when we're driving around. Um, what was I going to say? Ooh. And at the spa, there's like windows all around so you can look out at the mountains while you relax. Like, I'm kind of sleepy. It's that good. I'm, yeah. You know, like, <laughs> we're definitely dragging a little like, bit because like, we're so calm. <laughs> we're so excited to like see what's Explore. around the snow. Yeah. But like, I'm tired. Yeah, we're going to sleep good tonight. <laughs> so we're going to go check out a couple like little shops that are recommended and we'll take you guys along. Okay, we just got Main Street in Stowe. It is absolutely so cute. Oh, there's the Shaw's General Store. These are bu There's like a bunch of little stores here we, we can ponder through. We should walk around. Yeah, let's do it. I, I love how they still have their Christmas decor up. Like it's so, it looks just so cozy with like the lights. Oh. Here's another country store. Is that a parking spot? That is a parking spot. What about here? Yeah, park here. Beautiful. Christmas stuff's on sale. That's so you if I've ever seen anything. <laughs> Watch it go and emotional. <laughs> Look at this little wiener. Oh, that's why that's so heavy. <laughs> is it a doorstop or something? This is cute. This is called the Stowe Mercantile. <laughs> Bitch, I am the secret ingredient. Guys, Yara and I have been smelling these soaps. <laughs> We're obsessed with the soaps. We're obsessed with the soap. They're all like so pretty. Oh my god. Ooh. Like, how can you not? <laughs> right? That's a good one. That's a good one. Wait, Bub, we're so dumb. We already smelled them all on that side because they're the same ones and we just smelled them all again. <laughs> this one smells like winter. Did you smell this one? It smells like Jack Frost. This one's good. Past curfew. This one smells like peaches. Okay. Oh. All right, so after shopping, we came back here, just rested for like an hour. That spa morning made us really tired, in a good way though. But we just hung out in the room for like an hour. Now we're gonna go grab dinner at the hotel at this, ho <laughs> grab dinner at the restaurant at this hotel. Um, it's called Charlie B's. The breakfast there was so bomb. So, oh my God, we picked this up at one of the little shops. It's an Oreo Rice Krispie Treat. We're gonna share that for dessert. And then I also picked up this. It's the Phone Grip Love Handle. Super cute, low profile, effortless grip, and it's got a little cheetah print. Because like I love having a pop socket, but I don't like to have it on because I can't use my wireless charger, like just the charging pad. So this supposedly works with the charging pad because I like to have something to like grip, but you just put your finger through. So I'll put that on later and I'll show you guys. Dinner! Yeah. 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 We're starving. Let's go. I'm hungry. You got a room key? Uh, I think so. Cool. Christmas lights! Do you want to show them how cute it is in here? It's so cute in here. I love it. So I'm going to put this on. My cute little cheetah print love handle. I love it. It's called a love handle. It feels good. So I'm trying to figure out where I want it. Okay. Alright, I'm just gonna go for it. It was like, take your time. Guys, we just made the funniest TikTok. If you're not following me on TikTok, please do it. It's basically like a, our TikTok. Most of it's like stuff of us together. Okay. 
Okay. All right. I feel a lot of pressure to get this straight. Do you think I can do it? Maybe. Well, you're using your fingers, so. Should be easy to get. The good thing is I have this apple to reference. Yeah. Oh, sh <laughs> you would. That is so you. It's so me. Oh my god. You got it? No. It doesn't feel right. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. That looks pretty centered. I did it. I committed. I'm gonna hold it down. I don't see how this is char wireless charging compatible. Well, I guess we'll find out in the room because I brought my wireless charger. Okay. That your mom gave me for okay. Christmas. Does that pair look pretty straight? Yeah, it looks good. Straight enough? Yeah. Okay. All right. Oh, I All right, like what's your it. Take? I love it. It's, I like it. Yeah. It's better than a pop socket because I love a pop socket, y'all, but like it's too bulky. Alex pop reviewing tech. I like this. Yeah, pop sockets are just like too bulky for me, so I love this because like this I can slide into my pocket and it won't feel. Oh, it's a little crooked. That's gonna bother me. What's the name of the company again? Love Handle. Yeah. We tore the Phone wrapper grip apart. Grip love Handle looks like this, but it says it's wireless charging capable, low profile, effortless grip. I'm doing a full review. No, oh, this is nice. This feel this feels nice. Yeah. I forgot how, how it feels to have like a secure thing on the back. Yeah, of the so phone. you don't have to. Yeah, it's just like shuffle nah. your hand around it as you're using it. Yeah. Right? yeah. Thank you. Good morning, Vermont. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. It's breakfast time. Tell them about your run. It was hard. <laughs> so I found this path that I thought was paved. It's like the Stowe Recreational Path, and. I said, great, it's a paved run. It's kind of snowy out here, but it was a paved run that I can take this path through. And like a half mile down the path, it was all snow. So I ran seven miles. <laughs> in snow? In snow. That's hard. You tough. It was annoying. You deserve a big breakfast. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm gonna eat. <laughs> Papa go eat. Papa go eat. We're gonna go get breakfast. And then we're heading home. This was so relaxing. Last night we were just hanging out in the room and had so much fun just like being goofy. We needed a, yeah. a goofy night. Yeah. Follow us on like, TikTok. <laughs> we have fun. Sure. Uh, link down below. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, let's go have breakfast. I'm hungry. We Me too. We hungry. It's almost 11. Okay, so breakfast was delicious again. We are going to hit the road and head home. And yeah, we'll see you there. This was awesome. Welcome back to Alex's kitchen. You know the first time I've had bulgogi? Was what like, is bulgogi? It's Korean beef, I think. That's like beef and bop? Yeah, it's, someone could correct us in the comments. It's probably not. Really. But no, no, it's not beef and bop. It's like, it's like beef, but like it, it's a style of beef that I was introduced to when I was in Korea. Cool. And um, the first time I had it, when you walk into a Burger King, they have like beef bulgogi burgers. Oh, ah, Because they're Korean like their menu to the yeah, um, yeah. local Is market. the bulgogi like a sauce or a style of beef? I think it's a sauce. Okay. I think. I don't know. I think it's it Korean. Seems, it seems like it's yeah. a style. It's a it's a Korean dish. Oh, bulgogi sauce. Okay, so it, it has in sauce. here. Yeah. Okay, cool. So like maybe we can compare and you can see if it tastes similar to the one you had in Korea? That was in, that was in 2012. That was in 2012, that was so eight years I'm ago. I'm gonna remember. Maybe you'll taste it and you'll be like, wow, I remember. Alright, get out. What? Get out. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, this sounds really good. This sounds It, it is really good. Really it's like good. a sweet, tangy. More sweet than anything. This looks it's like really delish. Good. Beef bulgogi with carrots, pickled cucumber, sriracha crema over jasmine rice. Alright, let's do it. Hello Fresh Baby! This is one we've never had before. We've never had this one. Hello. Hello. Fresh. Okay, we have carrots. Sesame seeds. Oh my god, look at these cute carrots. They're already shredded. Love that for us. Sesame seeds. Scallion. Cukey. White wine vinegar. I love how they give you just the right amount so there is little to no waste. 
Everything is pre-packaged ingredients right to your door. Jasmine rice, sweet Korean barbecue bulgogi sauce. HelloFresh is my boo. Sour creamies. Sriracha. We had a HelloFresh last night. What did we have last night? The tortellini. Ooh, sauce of tortellini. Yeah. That Ooh, was that was fire. That like. was fire. And you know what? He thinks I'm an amazing cook. I learned it from HelloFresh. I don't think anyone believes me because it's sponsored, but this is like a real, real thing. I did not cook as good as I cook now until I learned HelloFresh like a couple years ago. And like it started teaching me like it basics. So basics good. of things. And now I can do my own thing as well. But this makes it easy. So. It's so good. It's true. Like I'm yeah. a stan, y'all. Don't even know how much I stan. Hello fresh. And you make it pretty quick too. It's usually it takes around 30 minutes, but it usually takes me less. Because I'm fast. Like. Because I'm fast. Yeah. Are you going to do it with me? You're really happy. <laughs> Should I show them how you eat that orange? Or are you going to get out of here? I'm going to get out of here because that's pay-per-view. <laughs> Watching Yarmin eat an orange is the most <laughs> sensual experience. <laughs> so, step-by-step -step instructions on the back. Super easy breezy. If you guys haven't seen me do this before, uh, I've been working with HelloFresh for a long time. Got my mom hooked on it. She buys it now. Yara's been using it from before when I met him. It's the bomb.com. All right, step one. Cook rice and prep. Wash and dry all of our produce. That's usually how it starts. So let's go ahead and cook this rice. Get our vegetables ready to go. Ooh, we're going to pickle some cucumber. I learned how to pickle stuff from HelloFresh as well by putting it in white wine vinegar. And a little bit of sugar and salt. Cool. All right, let me get this rice going. Okay, so here's the situation. We have our ribbons of cucumber now getting pickled. Set aside, the rice is simmering, cooking. So now the next step is to drizzle a little olive oil in a pan. And we're gonna cook the carrots. I love that these are pre-shredded because I kind of hate shredding carrots. <laughs> That's wonderful. So much easier and saves us so much time. So for about a minute, I'm just going to stir these around. Let them get cooked. Salt and pepper them. Then we're going to cook our beef. Add in our scallion whites. Then get that bulgogi going. The sriracha crema sounds amazing. I'm super excited to make that. Okay, so I now have the beef cooking. Everything's coming together. This one was really easy to make and it seems like it's gonna taste bomb. So something about HelloFresh that I love is that they have low calorie, vegetarian, and family style recipes every single week so you have lots of option. And you do have the option to add extra meals to your weekly order or like fun sides like garlic bread, cookie dough. I love that they added that. All right, looks like our beef is almost done. Then we're gonna make our Sriracha crema. HelloFresh taught me how to make cremas. I did not know how to make those before. And it's not like it's hard. I just didn't know. Like it just makes you learn the basics of cooking. It's really cool. If you guys want to check out HelloFresh, you can go to HelloFresh.com and enter the promo code FEARLESS10 for 10 free meals and free shipping. And I will put a link down below to make it that much easier. All right, let's make this crema. All right, so the beef is cooked with the sesame seeds, vinegar, um, and then the sweet Korean barbecue bulgogi sauce. So the crema is super easy. It's literally just sour cream and sriracha. And then you add tiny bits of water at a time until it's like a drizzled consistency. All right, so it's finally time to plate. We have our pickled cucumber sriracha crema, our beef, and our cooked rice. So now I'm just gonna plate it. This is my favorite part. Should I expect less? Nah. Nah. Wow, that was good. Right? We're gonna eat together, but I just wanted to like do this on camera. It looks really good. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Presentation looks dope. Thank you. I'm trying to get a full bite. Yeah. Love that. So I'm expecting a sweet slash tangy. <laughs> Look at you. <laughs> You're so cute. Every time, HelloFresh delivers. How long does it take you to make? Honestly, like 20 minutes. That's crazy. Right. Crazy. And you're not putting anything away. No, that's like just what you need. all the ingredients you're using. It. No, little to no waste. Yep. Love you, HelloFresh. You guys are the and bomb. And the portions? 
It's, they're perfect. Like, they're perfect. Oh, it's wonderful. Mm. Go to HelloFresh.com and the promo code FEARLESS10 and have a moment like this. That's a thumbs up. That's a huge thumbs up. 10 free meals and free shipping. Thumbs up. <laughs> no, seriously though, like if HelloFresh, if we stop working with HelloFresh, like we're still going to buy HelloFresh. Like. It's so convenient. It's amazing. Really? Yay. I'm glad you like it, bub. We've been watching the Super Bowl. We don't really care about the Super Bowl. We're in it for the commercials. Um, there were a few really good ones. I care about the Super Bowl, just not about the team. Exactly. If it was like the Pats, we'd be popping off. We'd be having a party. But I just made banana bread for the first time ever, so I thought we would try it on camera. It's been cooling. I think it's ready to go. So one of you guys actually sent me a DM and told me how to make it like with applesauce. They say it's more moist. So I've never made banana bread. Let's try it out. Okay, literally just based <laughs> on like cutting it, it looks super moist. So thank you so much for the recipe. Um, we put walnuts in it as well. So are you ready to taste test? You're the taste tester of this channel. Right. <laughs> you really are. Right. <laughs> I'm so excited. I've never made banana bread. I don't know what to expect. It's really good. Really? Yeah. I'm... Is it moist? Sorry. Supposedly the applesauce the is apple like the sauce secret. Makes it. Yep. Yeah. She looks dense. She's thick. Mm. Yeah. Mm. -hmm. Yep. And usually the end isn't. I like the middle. That's just me. So if you like the end, that's a good sign. Whoever made that suggestion, you rock. Thumbs up, you rock. Are you recording now? I am recording now. Wow. Oh, she's warm inside. I hate myself. Alex. 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 You're gonna have name. to take that checkbox when you upload that YouTube. <laughs> this is not for kids. Oh. Yep. She's so wonderful. Did you touch? Please just touch her. Just, I, th I have mine. But mine is warm. Yeah. Ooh. It's good. That's good. I'm going to link below the recipe that girl sent me. You rock. Shout out to you, girlfriend. Appreciate you. Oh my god. Are you still recording? Yep. All right. Back to Superbook commercials. Yep. Good morning. Happy Monday. I have been running errands all morning. <laughs> all morning. Um, so first, what did I do this morning? Oh my God, my brain is not working. I went to the psychiatrist. Uh, I met my friend Alexis and we grabbed breakfast. I haven't seen her in a while. And now I'm... All the way in Rhode Island. <laughs> I've been all over. I was near Boston. Now I'm near Rhode Island. I'm in Rhode Island. It's just one of those days where like all my errands are just like all over. Oh, I love this hair. Thank you, Desi Perkins. If you guys didn't see this in last week's vlog, or is it two vlogs ago? I followed the Desi Perkins hair tutorial for like the natural looking curls. I'm obsessed. Anyway, I need to go drop something off and then I will be driving home. <laughs> Not very exciting. Just like a lot of running around today. Also, I got these lashes on Amazon and they're actually so good. They're so good. I'm being stared at. It's the huge. Good morning, y'all. How is everyone doing? So today is now Tuesday. Tuesday. And I am heading to the hair salon. I'm so excited. I haven't gotten my hair done in quite a while now. Well, the last time I did, we were just doing kind of like a touch up where we kind of like just tone and like refresh. But like today we are doing the full shimming and I am so ready to like go brighter, blonder. I feel like every time I just love to like refresh and go super blonde. And it's kind of, it's just like with the water where I live, it naturally kind of darkens my hair. Cause now it kind of feels like, I don't know. To me, it looks like a dirty blonde. But usually when I leave the salon, it's like a bright, almost platinum blonde. So whenever I get to go and do like the full shebang with the hair and like the full redo, it brings me back to like that bright platinum blonde because naturally like the toner fades and the water has stuff in it that makes my hair darker. <laughs> but I'm also really into the way my roots look lately. Um, I'm really into like the dark root. So I'm hoping we can kind of keep 
the rooted look, maybe like an inch of root. Um, so it's kind of blended because like when it's like all blonde and then it grows out, like I love the way it looks when it's a little bit grown out. So I'm hoping we can kind of do that, but just really brighten up. And then next week I'm going back and they're going to, because we couldn't do it all in one day today because it would just take way too long. I'll probably be there for like four hours today alone with just the color. But I'm going back next week to do this really cool new haircut. I'm going to take you guys along. I can't remember the name of it. It has like a cool name. Um... <sighs> But it's basically for people like me with long, really thick hair, and you don't want to take off length, but you want it to be more movable and just like more body and flow because it can get really heavy and weighted and like just kind of feel, you know what I mean? When you have just like a lot of hair and it just feels like, ugh. So apparently this cut, like they go into your hair and like you keep the length, but it gives it like a lot of lift and body and movement and lightens up the thickness and the weight of the hair. So that sounds great. I was like, when I heard about that, I'm like, yes, sign me up, please. So we're going to go back to our girl over at B Lux Salon. Oh my God. I love her so much. Heather is just the best. We have the best chats. Um, everyone in that salon is amazing. So if you're in Massachusetts, definitely check them out. It's just like a really happy environment. Like it's got really good vibes. So we're gonna be going there, hanging out with Heather, getting our hair done. And yeah, it's gonna be a good day. A good day. And then I have to come home and get some work done. Heather's husband brought in munchkins, and I'm literally just holding them <laughs> We're eating them while she foils. <laughs> we needed some nourishment. <laughs> nourishment. It's a lot of hair. It's a lot of hair. <laughs> My hair. Heather and I have had so much fun today, guys. Um, we had a lot of laughs, but my hair looks so good. We went super bright. She gave me a little bit of a smudged root so it grows out super nice. I love this girl. Please come see her if you're in mass. I love this girl too. She's the best. <laughs> hey guys. Okay, so I just realized I never <laughs> filmed after I left the hair salon. But it's the next morning. Roots are fresh. We went a lot blonder because we usually do like partial foils. But we went through and did like the whole head. So I'm just like much more full blonde and brighter and better than ever. Can you see a little better in this light? I feel like on camera it doesn't look as blonde, but it's super blonde. <laughs> so today's Wednesday. I'm going to go film a different video with Nikki again because I want to try lots of beauty treatments with you guys and start this series on my channel. So I'm going to go do that and then I'll meet up with you guys and we'll hang out. Okay, you guys can see the blonde a little bit better. Yes. I actually am at the exact two week mark on my nails. I think I'll actually go get my nails done first. I have a little time before I go see Nikki. I can't decide if I want to go back to French <laughs> white or like a French ombre that they do with the powder where it like fades together. Let's go see what we choose. So today with Nikki, when this vlog's up, that video will already be up. So maybe you've already seen it, but she does dermaplaning um, and I've been doing dermaplaning at home. I both have the Derma Flash which I've tried. It's essentially like the little face razors and it vibrates. And I personally don't think it's any better than just using like a face razor and I think it's pretty expensive. So essentially I'm kind of curious, is getting professional dermaplaning different? Cause I've done it th like three ways now. I've done it with just the little tinkle razors. So it's a plain face razor that you get the peach fuzz off. And I've done it with the Derma Flash, which is like a vibrating face razor. And honestly, with both, I feel like it looks really nice. It gets the peach fuzz off, your dead skin, your makeup looks better, products absorb better. But I feel like I can never get all the hair off. Like I always feel like there's still like a tiny bit of like almost stubble um, with the peach fuzz. It doesn't look like 
stubble or anything and I've never had my hair grow back darker I think that's a myth but I want to try doing it professionally and seeing if it's different because she told me it's like a medical grade scalpel scalpel <laughs> it's like basically what they use in surgery and you can get like all that hair off and I don't know I'm just kind of curious if I'll notice a difference so I'm going to kind of compare and we're going to do some other fun beauty treatments so I thought it'd be a fun video because I'm doing like that beauty series on my channel now so all right let's go get our nails done okay we'll see what I choose I have no idea all right nails are done so I got the French dip powder on my natural nails and I really love the way it came out I need a little cuticle oil but she did such a good job like the shape Woo! she did that she did that so I got myself a little treat so I get this every year it's my favorite thing Dunkin Donuts comes out with it every Valentine's Day and it's their brownie batter um <laughs> donut and it's amazing i get it every year that they've had it i don't know if it's been like a few years now but i treat myself every year to this donut and i can't wait to get the comments about how i'm a fat pig eating my donut i'm a normal person and i eat with balance and i feel good about that i feel the happiest and healthiest i have in a long time and i'm not gonna justify eating a donut anymore i'm gonna eat my donut it's a good donut you guys have to try it it's so good okay so it's much later in the day now i just went to my derma planning i came home and edited that video because it's going to go up tomorrow and then i am now here picking up yar from the train station sometimes i just drop him at the train station because he commutes to boston and then sometimes i'll pick him up um if he has like crossfit so it's just easier than him like driving here and i i like to pick him up and drop him off i feel like a mom that's weird, isn't it? That was a weird thing to say, Alex. I can't stop looking at my nails. Like, they don't even look real. The new place I go is so good. So good, so good. Wow. Like, they're, they look like just eggs. <laughs> and I also picked up the computer. I don't think I told you guys. We brought our computer to this, like, Mac repair shop and got, like, a new... I shouldn't even be saying this. That's that's ER's department. He's so tech savvy. Like I'm so lucky that he's so tech savvy cuz I ever since I upgraded my well most of my videos to 4K, they are so much harder to edit. Like my computer will shut down all the time and just freeze and it's just it's been a pain. So we got something boosted. I think an upgraded hard drive maybe. So I brought that home too, and I'm super excited to see if it works any faster. And Yar has a basketball game tonight, so I think I'm going to do a little self-care. Self-care. <laughs> um, it's been a stressful week, so yeah, I think we do like a face mask. I just got a new one from Laneige. And new Shane Dawson video. I'm excited. Okay, so it's the next morning after doing dermaplaning. Don't mind me, like it's still early. But I just put on my foundation. I have not set or anything else, no concealer, nothing. But I just put on my foundation and I wanted to show you guys how good my skin looks with foundation on after dermaplaning with no peach fuzz and that top layer of dead skin off. If you guys haven't watched that video yet, please do because it's amazing and it's really satisfying to watch the hair come off. Oh, I hope you can tell on camera how smooth the skin looks. So I'm going to finish my makeup and like set and everything and then I'll show you guys how it looks. But so far, like a huge difference putting on foundation. And here's what my makeup looks like all finished. I feel like it just looks super glowy and fresh and the makeup is sitting so nicely on it because there's no hair at all. I'm officially obsessed with dermaplaning. Also, I feel like my, I can't tell if they're like a little messy, but like I think my lashes look pretty good. This mascara, oh, I put it away. It's the Lancome Big Monsieur, and it is like really, really good. I've been loving that mascara and then the Lancome Hypnose Drama, but I'm lashless. I'm lashless. All right, I have a few appointments today that I have to go to. All right, so Lily and I just had dinner, and now we're at Target on a Friday night because it's what we do. So I'll show you guys 
What's going on at Ye Old Target? That one better. <gasps> Look at the wow. Ooh, wow. So mercury. Cashmere plum. Oh, she's nice. I like her. That's good. So sparkly. What did you say this was? What did you just say? Mercury? mercury. What? It's like, it's like a, like, Is that like a crystal? It's like a type of like glass. Ah, like the broken looking glass? Yeah, and like usually like shiny. I don't know. Well, I like that you knew that. I respect you. Because <laughs> I did not know. Oh, these are cute. Very springy. Oh, you need that. That's so you. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Girl, you are talking with me. What do you What do you think I'm gonna say? Oh my god. But like, don't you think I maybe need like a random jar full of fake lemons? <laughs> so, what I'm doing is, because Gabby's my original boyfriend, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna send her a little Galentine's package down to Disney. So, I already got her a couple things at home. I'm just gonna get her a couple other cute little Valentine's things. Things she can use while she's down there. If you guys didn't know, she's in the Disney College program right now. She's thriving. Willie's trying to find a card for her boyfriend's birthday. This should not be so hard. <laughs> no, I spend like 30 minutes looking at cards usually. It actually provides a lot of anxiety for me. He has like a weird sense of humor. And I'm like, none of these like... <laughs> <laughs> like a poop joke. A poop joke. Oh, you're not in the right section. You're in like the like the, I'm in the hipster the cards. I like. Exactly. Come I'm on. Me right Come on. Now. We need to go. <laughs> we need to go to the funny section. Find him something about poop. Just doing a quick sweep of the plus here. They have some really cute straight leg high waist jeans that actually look like pretty trendy and good. I definitely don't need any, but. Let's see, I wanted to pick up some basics, but it's looking pretty, pretty drab. Oh wait, here's more. Some t-shirts. So I tried this on, originally I grabbed a 3X, I wanted it to be roomy, but it looked kind of just like lost in shape, so I put on a 2. I can button it with my arms. I mean, it's on sale for $15. Funniest thing ever, Lily walks around the corner and I'm like <laughs> about to put another makeup brush in the car and then she goes... All right, so this is my mandatory, my eyebrow pencil, and then this is my splurge this week. It's my liquid eyeliner. I don't wear it often, but when I do, it's always a good time. Okay, so I'm picking out stuff to do a drugstore makeup tutorial, and then I come over to Lily. What and is she, the point? She goes, why are there so many different size makeup sponges? I always thought you just used one. And I was like, oh, well, they came out with different sizes for like under your eyes, and she's like, this is content. <laughs> This trip went well. I'll do a haul when I get home. Okay, I'm home from Target. Whew, Lily and I, we both had long weeks, so we thought we would do a little retail therapy, starting with this bear. Hello. What do we want to name him? I don't know. What do you look like to me? It was $15, and I always look at these big bears and like, when Yara's away at military stuff, I'm gonna sleep with this bear. You may judge me, but it was $15. I've always wanted one. Picked up this thing to mail something. Look at this cute rug. 
or doormat <laughs> and says, yay, you're here. It's only $13 and $12. And the one I have out there now is from Christmas. <laughs> and it says, um, here comes Amazon. Here comes Amazon right down my driveway. So I got our favorite laundry detergent as of late because yours clothes are stinky from working out and that stuff works really well. I got this Soap and Glory shower gel, Clean On Me. I really like Soap and Glory. I don't buy them a lot, but I really do enjoy when I buy. I got these for the house, conversation hearts. I don't know, I like holiday things. I got a new dry shampoo that I've never used before. It's from Colab. It says it has amazing oil absorption without white residue. They were out of Batiste, so I thought I'd give this a try. We'll see. I picked up a new white, br white brush, <laughs> a new wet brush because mine is um, really old and all the bristles are like falling apart. I've had it for a long time. And I got it in this little cheetah print. <laughs> this is just the original detangler. If you have thick hair that gets knotted easily, this is amazing. I know someone's gonna want me to fix my necklace. <laughs> all right. I also got some brush cleaner, cleaner, okay, yeah. Brush cleaner from Sonia Kashuk. So I also picked up a lot of new brushes from Sonia Kashuk because all of my brushes are actually very old and I want to still have them. But when I clean brushes, I wanna know, like I only have right now like one for each portion of the face. And I feel like people have multiple because like if one is dirty with a certain color, you still have something and I don't have that right now. Like I don't have a lot of makeup brushes. So I wanted to stock up and I got all these from Sonia Kashik. I am gonna be doing a full face of drugstore, like a chit chat drugstore tutorial soon. And I'll use all these. But I love Sonia Kashik brushes. I've had some for a long time from her. I picked up a couple things for Gabby's little Galentine's package. There's this cute little deodorant for like in her purse or her backpack because she's in Florida. These chocolates. She loves chocolate. Another little chocolate. <laughs> I got myself some Boom Chicka Pop, one of my favorite snacks. Oh, I picked up these pants. They're from a new day. Yeah. I got them in an XXL and they are just like wide leg high waist trousers. Oh, they're kind of dusty. But I love wearing just like high waist pants with like a cute crop top. So they're simple, but they're cute. I picked this up. Um, I, right now, <laughs> I have this cup that I drink from. It has a bunch of office stickers on it uh, that Alexis gave me for Christmas. But other than that, I use Yar's Yeti a lot. But he's always using his Yeti. So I wanted my own like kind of travel situation here this is from the brand reduce and i love that it has a three-in-one lid so it has like a straw and then like also like a cap i don't know i thought it was cool i got some little like confetti paper shred stuff to put in gabby's package so i wanted to get a serum with glycolic acid in it to start using because i want to use something at night that's a little more intense and this is supposed to help with dark spots and discoloration. So it's from the brand La Roche Posay. I never used it before, but I want a stronger serum for at night. And I'm going to use my Mario Badescu in the morning. I also got these for Gabby for her little package because she's in a dorm now. And I thought like it would be cute to have like some cute Valentine's plates and napkins because she's cooking a lot in her dorm. I picked up another one of these. I've been using this for years. It's the It's a 10 Miracle Leave-In Plus Keratin Treatment Spray. I got into this back in beauty school like a really long time ago and it's great if you have like bleached, colored, um, I mean especially bleached because it removes keratin and this has keratin in it, but I spray this in my hair after I get out of the shower and then I brush it out with my wet brush so it doesn't like damage my hair but this stuff helps so 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 much with damage it's expensive but it really works and this lasts me like months and i have a lot of hair <laughs> so i did end up picking up that jacket <laughs> it was 15 dollars, and i love it it's like the perfect spring trench coat i got it in a 2x the 3x was just a little too roomy for me but um 
I like it. So I got her this card because she's in Disney. It says, no, what's more special than Valentine's Day? You. <laughs> Cute. Because she's in Disney, so it makes sense. Oh, I tried this the other day, the Cherry Coke Zero energy drink. I think it tastes really similar to just like regular Cherry Coke Zero. Like a little different. I picked up a couple of those, but I liked it. And then the rest of this bag is drugstore makeup that I got for the video. You can't even see inside, but it's a lot. I got a step for every step of the face. Some products I already know and love. Some new products and products I've heard are amazing from other people. And I really needed more hair ties, so... That's what I got from Target. So, you guys had a military thing this weekend. So I am gonna snuggle up with this bear and watch TikTok. I think it's safe to say Yarman is over my obsession with TikTok, but that won't stop me. All right, guys, I'm gonna wrap up the vlog here and go edit this for you. Hopefully you enjoyed. I'll see you guys in Tuesday's video. Bye. Thank you.